it's a welcome back to the Tesla. Yes, it's back. Uh, fresh from Cambridge Auto Glean. Picking it up the other day was like how I wished it would have been when I picked it up from Tesla in West Drayton. All perfect and fully detailed and protected and ready to go. So today we're going to play around with version 8, see what's changed, uh, see what some of the new features are, weather looks good today, so hopefully it will stay clean. So let's get driving. <laughs> Tesla looks great, but I've just got in it for a whole nice day of playing with all the features. Driver assistance features unavailable. So I think what we're going to do is we'll do a reset because that seems to be the answer for everything. Yep, still unavailable. Oh, shit in hell. So that's it. All the features unavailable today. Great, isn't it? Really looking forward to using this bloody car. So, are the gates going to work? Is that a driver assistance feature? Yes, the gates oh, work. Gates work. <laughs> Phone Tesla technical support. Where is Grant Street? It's asking me the bloody question. <laughs> Lost 20 miles, we've only done about five. Woo! Been raped by an I8. We've arrived at Cambridge and we're parked up. Tesla, I8. We're gonna have some breakfast. Someone has to park next to you, that's in an absolute shit heap. That is so eerie. Someone works. I like it now. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice that it worked. And driver assistance features are now available. <laughs> Driving aids are all functional for now. <laughs> Until Mr. Elon Musk decides he no longer wants you to use them. He's got a big control centre with a big red button and he can disable everything at the touch of a button. I, I, I guarantee you. So we're now on autopilot. Version 8 software running. Oh God, no. That didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> that was a central reservation that yeah. he hadn't spotted. It doesn't, it doesn't understand like little islands. No, it doesn't, doesn't it understand just goes, curbs. I could go over that or I could go around it. Wow. That was pretty evasive. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Where are we going? Ferrari Aston Martin. No, we're not. No, we're not. I can't believe it. <laughs> we're going to Aston Martin and Porsche. Porsche in Cambridge. It's a really short-lived trip to um, Aston Martin and Porsche. Porsche have got nothing particularly interesting. And Aston Martin have got a load of Aston Martins. Hello. Wow, hello. Your RS won't start. Yep. And your bike's leaking. Having an oily piss. You're sick yeah. of the RS6. Seven hundred and sixty-two horsepower electric vehicle. Does it feel like you're sat in a seven hundred and sixty-two horsepower electric vehicle? It's a bit boring, if I'm honest. <laughs> <laughs> And the bike was fine. It was just a, an oil leak off the chain. Not even a leak, just oil off the chain. So, uh, 
they kindly cleaned it all up for him. Back on the road. This is your uh, recently upgraded Triumph. It is indeed. SC Project exhaust system, baffle out, so it's absurdly loud. Oh my God, it's diesel. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just joking. It's unleaded 95. Just put the car into max battery power mode with creep turned off. Activate launch mode. We go. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, quick. Done, job done. We've had a day in the Tesla. What have we learned? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, this is meant to be a video about version 8. We've discovered very little. We have. Um, we had a problem this morning which sorted itself, as I'm sure all these things do, after a switch and on and off. Um, we've used autopilot. We've used summon. We summoned it in and out of parking space, which good. is quite cool. That's quite cool. With that. Just done a ludicrous launch mode, so why wouldn't you? And uh, apart from that, we've eaten a lot. Which is uh, <laughs> which we'd have done anyway, which is great. Um, so yeah, okay. that's that. Yeah.